Ladies and gentlemen, my name's Paul, and in this Red Game to the Comp video, we're going to be discussing NVIDIA, because they have added telemetry into their latest drivers. Telemetry, in and of itself, is not normally malicious in intent, or doesn't have to be malicious in intent, but it has certainly got a bit of a dirty name for itself, especially with the whole Windows 10 situation. We'll discuss that more in a moment. Now, just to clarify, NVIDIA adding telemetry into their own drivers, we don't necessarily have to look at it as in they are trying to spy on you and trying to get your credit card details. Obviously, that might be a bit um, over the top, but you get the idea. It could be as simple as they are trying to find out why a driver is crashing. For the sake of argument, you install the game, whatever title you may be enjoying, with a particular operating system, for example, Windows 10, and you have, let's say, a set of antiviruses running and whatever else, and the application crashes. Why does it crash? Well, of course you can submit bug reports and all of that stuff, but it is a little slower. So, presumably, assuming that you know it is for non-malicious intent, which I imagine it would be, NVIDIA would get a lot of um, data back and they would be able to notice a pattern and say to themselves, oh, okay, this is why it's crashing, and presumably bug fixes would be faster. With all of that said, I have a couple of qualms with this, the first of which is they did not mention it in their changelog, which to be honest is the minimum that I would expect, and I guess amending to that, for them to say to us, hey, this is why we're adding it, this is the data it is collecting, this is the data it is not collecting. For example, it's not collecting what web browser tabs you've got open, or it is not telling you, you know, it's not telling them, you know, your name or necessarily personal identification information that would be nice um, and it's not necessarily once again that we expect them to be collecting that stuff it's more for them to clarify that they're not collecting the stuff because people are getting kind of antsy with this uh, type of um, I wouldn't I hasten to use the word spying but I guess that's the that's the best way to put it in a simple way now the other issue I've got is that they didn't have an opt-out which would, in my opinion, be the best case scenario for have an opt-out and also to tell you, hey, this is the information that we are going to collect. So, for example, if Firefox crashes or Chrome crashes, generally there will be a, um, hey, this application crashed, do you want to send the data over to whichever corporation to help them identify and fix this particular issue with an update? With all of that said, the folks who spotted this over at Major Geeks have pointed rightly out that you can use an application called Microsoft Auto Runs. So Auto Runs is a standalone application, in other words, you do not need to install it. Instead, all you need to do is download it. I've put the link in the video description, and I have also put the link to the original article in the video description. So all you have to do is download and, and uh, unzip the application and then right click on it and run it as an administrator. You don't necessarily have to do that, but if you don't, you may get a um, warning that says, hey, you are lacking sufficient permissions when you're trying to make uh, amendments to the, um, to the auto run, which we'll go into in a moment. Then you simply type NVIDIA in the filter box, and then you scroll down, and then you simply disable telemetry, you simply uncheck them, save it, restart your system, and Bob's your uncle, and that's pretty much it. And it is a bit of a shame. From what we can tell at the moment, it seems to be limited to GeForce experience with the drivers, but there are some people who are telling us that this is not the case. There's conflicting reports, in other words, and so I guess the information will, as usual, come out in the next couple of days or so, and hopefully NVIDIA will also release a quote and tell us what the heck's been going on. Anyway, I think that's just about it for this video. Hopefully you found it useful, the normal stuff. If you've liked it, like it, and all of that. But for now, I'm going to get going. Take care of yourselves. Have a good day.